Nick, let me ask you real quick. Yankees, obviously, they don't want the Red Sox celebrating clinching <laughs> in, in their not. backyard. So it, wherever this is, big picture win for the Yankees because they want that home field in the wild card Yeah, as there's well. no doubt. And I think right there, listening to Aaron Judge saying he wants to be in there, I think the biggest question mark in my mind was the swings and misses. Obviously, when you're making contact, everything feels intact. He took a couple real good hacks tonight and swung through some balls. Looked like the wrist felt good. And obviously, when you have a guy like this in your lineup, the overall attitude, the overall confidence level is through the roof because of number 99. Yeah, I look at three things, Chris. There's three things, and it's all about intensity. You understand the fans are excited that Aaron Judge is in there, and obviously you see Aaron Judge having the ability to come in and be in that lineup. There's a different sense of, of excitement, and then also the intensity of what the Yankees need. The right. Yankees need this series against Boston because they've been flat, four and six in the last ten games, and it's been uncomfortable for the Yankees. They're looking for consistency. Do they have the ability? Yes, but now they have Aaron Judge, and I think he has been their leader, including last year and this year, and they need this presence. That's important for this series. Yeah, they were able to win the game with just three hits. Obviously, Walker coming through with the big hit. As you watched the game, was there something that concerned you with the Yankees? Yeah, well, there were a lot of great yeah. things going on. And, and instead of talking about it, I'm actually just going to show you exactly what I'm talking about right now. And what I want to talk to you right now is Giancarlo Stanton. This guy is an absolutely humongous piece here for the New York Yankees. But what I want to focus on right now is his left foot. Right now, this man's power is to the right side of the field, right center. There's no way you're going to be able to make contact with power if you're stepping in the bucket, if your hips are opening up to the pull side of the field. Giancarlo back in June, July, and August, when things were going really well, he was hitting the ball to right center with authority and power. Right now, if he wants to get back to that spot, it looks like to me he's a little bit on his heels. It looks like he's stepping back in this unathletic position. I think if he wants to get back to being Giancarlo that we all know and love, get in a more athletic position and take that front stride foot towards second base. Catch those baseballs a little deeper in the zone. And obviously, if Giancarlo's hitting fly balls in Yankee Stadium, they're usually going to end up from home runs.